How would you describe the St. Barnabas versus St. Rita rivalry? Just roll the clip. Very intelligent team tonight. Then oh. Wallace was fouled, and Wallace did. Oh, oh. Wallace right at our chest. This has potential to be serious if they don't get between. Wallace upset. Players trying to hold each other off. Oh. Steven Jackson will receive Wallace trying to be peacemaker. Now Jackson yelling. Wallace still going. You need the coaches in there to get him away. Where did this rivalry originate? I mean, to be completely honest with you, it goes all the way back to middle school football. I mean, everyone out there knew we were the two best teams, and it was always a battle. Parents, players, coaches, officials, they all knew it was going to be a great game, and it could go either way. And that's where it all started. Yeah, the, I mean, the rivalry just grew so big. After middle school football, it spread to other sports and into high school. And here we are, senior year, CYO basketball. This is it. You know, so we're at the peak of our rivalry, and it all comes down to this one. What have you done to prepare for this game? Over at St. Rita, we don't do much practicing. I mean, we're better than them in all aspects of the game. We shoot better, we score better, we're faster, we're quicker, we jump higher. I mean, I'm not really worried about those boys over in Macedonia. Over here at St. Barnabas, we know we're the underdogs, so we need to take every advantage we can to win this game. So every week, we send a scout to the St. Rita games to pick up on their game plan. And we, we're pretty confident that we get everything down to lock them up, and we can win this game. Yeah, I mean, we're practicing three days a week, one game a week. We have a 6-1 and one record right now. Um, but, I mean, every game, everyone on our team is thinking about one thing, and it's the ending goal. I mean, St. Reed is all we want. We want to play their best. I'm, I'm actually watching film right now. I mean, the amount of preparation going into this season with the goal, knowing that we're going to face Rita's in the championship is just it's crazy. As a Walsh Jesuit student, what does this rivalry look like from outside perspective? So, I would say in the school, outside of school, the tension is, it's really hot. I mean, there's fights breaking out everywhere. Teachers have to jump in. They're breaking up fights. I mean, I went to Barnabas and I even knew. Before a big game, everyone was nervous. Everyone was, no one would talk to each other. Like, Everyone was locked in, prepared for the big game. The game was finally here. All this preparation and hard work we put into it is finally going to pay off, and we're going to beat St. Rita. I mean, there's no doubt in my mind we were winning this game. No preparation needed, but, I mean, like I said earlier, we were just already better athletes all around. The beginning half of the game was a, it was a back-and-forth game. It was close. If I recall correctly, we were up by a small margin at the beginning, and that was a small amount of hope we needed to carry us through. Yeah, I mean, at the beginning of the game, it uh, it started off pretty rough for us. We were missing shots, couldn't couldn't get any to fall. And then uh, I remember I, hit, I knocked down a three in the corner over there and brought some life back in the team. We were able to get on a little run there and score some points. The most intense part of the game. Definitely the most intense part of the game was when I was going to box out Casey Kish, their center, and he just decided to toss me over his knee, just out of nowhere. So me being the competitor I am, I ran over, tried to start some something with him, and instead, he just decided to like body slam me to the ground. It hurt, but I got back up, didn't let it stop us from winning, and just got back out. What was the outcome of the game? At the end of the day, you know, we ended up pulling away. I think uh, there was some internal shutdown between St. Rita. There just wasn't the same chemistry that Barnabas had. And it turned out all the practice and preparation that we did leading up to that moment really paid off. And I was ecstatic. And uh, it's great to know that we won the last game between Barnabas and Rita ever, which I think makes us the... Winners of the rivalry. I'm only here so I don't get fined.